Good dear students, I am Ajay Karmarkar. Before starting this video, I would like to say something. Please sit with copy pen. If you find somewhere important, then note it and proceed further. And although you have facing any problem or difficulties, please write in comment box. I will definitely solve your problem. And along with, please like, share and subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students. Thank you. Now here is the question. A square metal wire loop of side 10 cm and resistance 1 ohm is moved with a constant velocity V0. In a uniform magnetic field of induction V equal to 2 Weber per meter square. According to the figure, the magnetic lines are perpendicular to the plane of the loop directed into the paper. The loop is connected to a network of resistance each of value 3 ohm. The resistance of the loop wire OS and PQ are negligible. What should be the speed of the loop so as to have the steady current of 1 milliampere in the loop? Give the direction of the current in the loop. According to Hewan, here this loop is partially inside and partly outside. And this is connected with this network of resistance and we have to find out the velocity of this loop. Okay, so first we have to find out the net resistance. We know that that is the Wheatstone arrangement because 3 ohm, 3 ohm, 3 ohm, 3 ohm and diagonally that is also 3. So therefore that is a net resistance 3 ohm and 3 ohm are in series because here no any deflection shows so we can here remove so 3 ohm resistance and 3 ohm resistance that is in series so 3 3 6 similarly 3 ohm 3 ohm also 6 so 1 upon r dash that is 2 by 6 1 2 1 the 2 2 3 the 6 then r dash equal to 3 ohm and this resistance of this loop only this side P to O that is 1 ohm. So net resistance 3 ohm and 1 ohm that is 4 ohm because here we have given already this is resistance is neglected. O to P to Q and O to S. So net resistance is 4 ohm. Okay. Here as we know that induced EMF due to this motional loop. V L V naught and I equal to current of this induced EMF that is induced EMF upon resistance then V L V naught upon R and we have to find out the velocity so it can be written as V naught equal to I into R and V into L. Now substitute all this value here I what is I is given? Now substitute all this value. Here I is given 1 milliampere means 1 into 10 raised to power minus 3. Resistance, net resistance is 4 ohm. And magnetic field, here magnetic field is given that 2 weber per meter square. And length is given that is 0 0.1 meter. Okay. 2 1s are 2, 2 2s are 4. And V naught equal to this uh, point is removed that uh, is 2 into 10 to the power minus 3 meter. Then we can, it can be written as 2 centimeter per second. That is the velocity. Second things we have to find out the velocity the direction. So from this formula, V not equal to I into R, V into L. So it's a direction along with this I. Okay. Thank you for staying till the end of this video. Definitely for your success all the credit goes to your hard work. But if my video will help for your success then I will consider myself lucky. Thank you once again. Take care. Bye bye.